Well, this is Big Jeff. Today I want to talk about our new elected president, Mr. Donald Trump. White people are giddy and elated and happy that Obama is leaving and Donald Trump is coming in. They are happier than a gay man in a penis factory. It's a shame. You know, white folks, it appears to me, they think that Donald Trump's going to take them to the promised land. They believe that America is not great. They're threatened by every race on earth. You say it. You know, African Americans don't have a history of enslaving anybody and doing some of the things that white folks have done. Indians don't have a history of taking from white folks. Mexicans do not have a history of trying to take stuff from white folks. But you guys are happy about Mr. Donald Trump. Racism is not free. It costs everybody something. You know what's funny about white America? And I'm saying this because you guys seem so happy. You guys are some of the scariest son of bitches I've ever seen on the face of this earth. Everybody is your enemy. I was watching TV the other day. There were some white kids in high school walking around with Donald Trump sign talking about white power. It's always been white power. It's nothing new. Do you white people believe just because we had an African American president that he was calling the shots? He's going to be just like Donald Trump. He can only do so much. Everybody's running scared. Black people are running scared. I have a friend in Atlanta, Georgia, was telling me about the racism things that's going on down there since Donald Trump had become our future president. And she's telling everybody to buy passports because they have to leave. Say it. They said the same thing about Reagan. Reagan was going to destroy the country, etc. I just hope Mr. Trump does not cause as many deaths as Mr. Bush did prior to Obama. Donald Trump is not going to have the ultimate say-so in this country. People are protesting and acting ass because he's president. There's nothing you can do. Remember, you pay the cost to be the boss. And all you white folks that, that voted for Donald Trump, congratulations. But I'm going to leave you with this. A hit dog will holler. And a dog need a bomb more than once. Somebody's going to be right. And somebody's going to be wrong. He would have never been president if it was one man, one vote. But it's all set up like that. There are more Democrats than there are Republicans. But of course, some Democrats and some sellout black people, some sellout Mexicans, etc., voted for Donald Trump. And that was their choice. But just remember, all you white folks, especially in the South, a hit dog will holler. And racism costs everybody something. Congratulations, Mr. Trump. Hope you do a good job. But the odds are against everybody but white folks. Thanks for listening. Have a nice day. Bye.